there has always been a relationship between hope and healing. Between knowing the love of Christ and expressing that love through action. Between truth and health. Jesus said that as believers, we should share the gospel of Jesus Christ with everyone, every tribe, tongue, and nation. He also said we would always have the sick and poor, and we must care for them. When we see suffering, it's not enough to say, God bless you, go in peace. We must respond. We must act. That's our mission. Africa needs hope. It needs help. It needs people who can promote and impact the kingdom of God. How can someone make such an impact? How can health professionals take part in establishing Christ-centered churches among all African peoples? Africa in La Mission began over a hundred years ago, and health ministries has always been an integral part of our vision. Back then, the norm was the mission hospital, but not anymore. While the reason for AIM Health Ministries has remained constant, kingdom impact through Christ-like relationships, the strategy and methodology has adapted to meet changing needs. The new norm is strategic partnerships. AIM no longer owns hospitals and clinics. We now partner with churches, NGOs, universities and government health providers institutions that have programs that have an overlap with our own vision. Through these partnerships, health professionals can have a specific intentional role in ministry through training others in healthcare, promoting leadership development, and participating in discipleship, bringing patients and colleagues into a deeper relationship with Christ. Africa in and Mission started in East Africa, but we didn't sit still. We now work in more than 20 countries, spanning the continent from north to south, with new opportunities for health ministries opening up all the time. But it's not just scalpels and stethoscopes. As well as curative medicine, AIM Health Ministries includes rehabilitation, community development, education and training, preventative medicine, palliative care and many more. The most important thing a person involved in health ministries can do is to develop Christ-like relationships. People are transformed through relationships, relationships with God and with His people. A common misconception about health ministries is that they exist only to provide a platform for real work, church planting. It's true that health ministry provides a valid reason for being in Africa, but it's so much more than that. Healthcare is real mission. God commands his followers to be obedient to him. And the word of God makes plain that we're to show mercy, compassion, and love. Through the obedient demonstration of this sincere love, Christ is made known through developing relationships with clients, patients, colleagues, and students. God can use these relationships to draw people to himself and make disciples, men and women empowered to reach out to others in the same way. Only through mature disciples can Christ-centered churches flourish. AIM Health Ministries continue to impact the Kingdom of God as Christ-centered churches are established amongst all African peoples. To realize this vision, we need to find godly, qualified health professionals, prepare them for cross-cultural team ministry, 
and support them in healthcare settings that provide accountability and opportunity. It's not about how my experience in Africa has impacted my life and faith, though the impact is profound. It's not just about healing the sick and caring for the physical needs of Africans, though this is rewarding and vital. AIM Health Ministries is about kingdom impact through Christ-like relationships. Kingdom impact through Christ-like relationships. Kingdom impact through Christ-like relationships. Christ